Looks like today is your Chucky day. Cool games, awesome prizes. And did we mention tickets? Yep, it's all here at America's number one birthday place. Come celebrate your birthday with us at Chuck E. Cheese's, where a kid can be a kid. In a morning of back-to-back -back adventures, Blaze and his friends are going to extremes with their hottest, all right. coldest, Whoa. wildest, <laughs> buggiest, Whoa. slickest, speediest, <laughs> sneeziest, <laughs> hugest challenges yet. Look out! Don't miss a morning of back-to-back -back adventures with Blaze, starting tomorrow at 11, right here on the Nick Jr. Channel. It's time to play with Nick Jr. Each play date with Peppa Pig encourages kids to expand their social and emotional development and explore the diversity of the world around them. I'm Peppa Pig. This is my little brother, George. This is Mommy Pig. And this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> And worms and butterflies. <laughs> Peppa and George are helping Grandpa Pig in his garden. <laughs> wow! What a beautiful butterfly. Grandpa, why do butterflies like flowers? They get their food from flowers. How? They have very long tongues. Longer than mine? <laughs> oh, yes. The butterfly's tongue is even longer than yours. She uses it to drink from the flower. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, oh Peppa, the butterfly thinks you're a flower. <laughs> I'm not a flower. I'm Peppa Pig. <laughs> she is so pretty. I want to be a butterfly. <laughs> Peppa is playing at being a butterfly. I'm a little butterfly. <laughs> George wants to play too. <laughs> George, I'm the butterfly. You have to be something else. I know. You can be a wriggly worm. <laughs> look, look, I'm a butterfly. <laughs> oh, dear. George does not want to be a worm. He wants to be a butterfly. George, when I was a little piggy, I used to like playing at being a worm. It's very easy to be a worm. I'll show you how. First, you have to lie down on the ground. Then, you wriggle around. Ha <laughs> I'm a wriggly worm. <laughs> George and Grandpa Pig are having such fun being wriggly worms. <laughs> I'm a little butterfly. I'm a little butterfly. <laughs> <laughs> look, look, I'm a butterfly. Yes, Peppa, you're a beautiful butterfly. <laughs> <laughs> Grandpa, George, what are you doing? We are wriggly worms. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be a wriggly worm too. I'm a wriggly worm. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm a wriggly worm. <laughs> I'm a wiggly worm. I'm a wiggly worm. How do you do? I love you. I'm a wiggly worm. <laughs> 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 that was fun. What animal do you want to be now? Hmm, I don't know. Look, Grandpa, there's a little frog. Why don't you play at being frogs? Hmm, frogs are not as pretty as butterflies or as wiggly as worms. But frogs do play a game you like. Hmm, do frogs play doll's houses? <laughs> Silly Pepper. What's your favourite game? Jumping in muddy puddles. <laughs> 
Yes, frogs love jumping in muddy puddles. <laughs> yes, George. Let's play frogs. <laughs> I'm a little froggy. <laughs> I'm a little froggy. <laughs> 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 Froggies have found a nice big muddy puddle to play in. <laughs> Pepper and George love jumping up and down in muddy puddles. Everyone loves jumping up and down in muddy puddles. <laughs> Butterflies and worms are very nice, but I like frogs the best. <laughs> <laughs> Brother George, this is Mummy Pig, and this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. The tree house. Pepper and George are visiting Granny Pig and Grandpa Pig. Granny Pig! Donkey Yig! Hello, my little ones. Before you come in the house, you must take off your muddy boots. Yes, Granny. <laughs> Peppa, George, look what I've made. Little curtains. Ooh. What are the little curtains for, Granny? It's a surprise. Do you want to see what Grandpa Pig has made for you in the garden? Yes, please. <laughs> Hello, Peppa, George. Look what I've made for you. A tree house. A tree house? For George and me? <laughs> and the little curtains are for your tree house. Hooray! <laughs> Peppa and George love their tree house. Thank you, Granny Pig. Thank you, Grandpa Pig. <laughs> Who wants to go inside first? Me, me. In you go, then. Before I go in my treehouse, I must take off my muddy boots. I'm in my treehouse. I'm in my treehouse. <laughs> George, would you like to go in the treehouse, too? Yes? Who is it? A young pig named George would like to pay a visit. Can he come in? As long as he takes off his muddy boots. George, take your boots off, then you can visit Pepper in the treehouse. <laughs> Who is it? George? <laughs> <laughs> yes? Who is it? It's Mummy Pig. Have you room for any more visitors? Hmm. You have to say the secret words. Then you can come into our house. <laughs> I see. And what are the secret words? I have to whisper them to you. The secret words are... Daddy's big tummy. I see. <laughs> <laughs> Say the secret words. Daddy's big tummy. That's right. Daddy's big tummy. <laughs> I think those are silly secret words. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy, before you come in our house, you must take off your boots. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> There's room for Daddy, too. Say the secret words, Daddy. Can I have different secret words, please? No. <laughs> oh, all right. Daddy's big tummy. <laughs> That's all right. You can come in now, Daddy. Take your boots off. Uh, uh, I don't think I can fit through the door. <laughs> That's because your tummy's too big. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Daddy Pig can climb in through the top. Peppa, George, Mummy Pig and Daddy Pig are all in the treehouse. <laughs> <laughs> Granny, I love our treehouse. I don't want to ever come out. That's nice, Peppa. But are you sure you don't want to visit me in my house? No, thank you, Granny. 
In that case, Grandpa Pig and I will just have to eat my homemade cookies all by ourselves. Cookies! <laughs> Granny Pig! Here are my homemade cookies. But if you want to come in, you have to say the secret words. That's easy. Daddy's big tummy. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> well, I still think that those are very silly secret words. <laughs> Pepper and George love feeding bread to ducks. <laughs> Brother George, this is Mummy Pig, and this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. The playgroup. Peppa and George are going to the playgroup. It is George's first day. George, are you looking forward to the playgroup? Maybe George is too small to go to my playgroup. He'll be fine, Pepper. There'll be you and Mr. Dinosaur there to keep him company. Grr, dinosaur. <laughs> but I want to play with the big children. Not George and his toy dinosaur. Oh dear. Pepper doesn't want George to go to her playgroup. Here. Daddy, are you sure George is big enough? He'll be fine. <laughs> All right. He can come. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Madame Gazelle looks after the children at the playgroup. My little brother, George. <laughs> Hello, George. <laughs> I wish I had a little brother like George. Really? Hello, I'm Danny Dog. <laughs> Is that a dinosaur? <laughs> it's just a toy dinosaur. Grr, dinosaur. Brilliant. <laughs> Dinosaur. Grrr. Ah! <laughs> Dinosaur. Grrr. Ah, really scary. <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant. George is my brother. He's brilliant. Pepper is proud of her little brother, George. <laughs> Shall we show George how we paint pictures? George is not very good at painting. Well, maybe you could help him. Yes, I'm very good. I will show him how to paint a flower. George, today I'm going to teach you how to paint a flower. <laughs> First, you paint a big circle. George, that's the wrong colour. <laughs> now you paint the flower's petals. George, <laughs> that's the wrong shape. <laughs> now you paint the stalk and the leaves. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> George, you've done it all wrong. Now, what do we have here? I've painted a flower. That's very good, Pepper. And George has painted a dinosaur. Grrr. Dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. I think George and Pepper's pictures should go on the wall. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Pepper, you must be very proud of your little brother. Yes, I am. No. It is home time, and the children's parents are here to pick them up. Can 
George come next time? Yes, and he can paint us another lovely picture. And what will you paint next time, George? Dinosaur. Grrr. Oh, another dinosaur picture? Well, maybe you can show us all how to paint a dinosaur. Brilliant. Yes, brilliant. Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Granny Pig and Grandpa Pig are making a treasure hunt for Peppa and George. Granny Pig is drawing the treasure map. Grandpa Pig is burying the treasure in a secret place in the garden. Grandpa Pig, have you finished? Peppa and George will be here soon. <laughs> no need to panic, Granny Pig. Pepper and her family are here. Quick, Grandpa Pig! They're here! Oh, almost done! <laughs> oh. Grandpa Pig oh. just finished in time. Oh. Granny Pig! We're here! Thank you, Pig! Hello, my little ones! Grandpa Pig! Papa Pig! Ahoy there, me heart is! Pepper? George, we've made you a treasure hunt. Somewhere in the garden is buried treasure. Wow, treasure. Where is it? Oh, you have to look for it. Here's a treasure map for Peppa. And George could wear my pirate hat. Ahoy there, Captain George. <laughs> the map is a bit difficult. Daddy, can you help? Of course, Pepper. I'm very good with maps. Uh, it is a bit difficult. <laughs> Daddy Pig, you're holding the map upside down. Yes, I thought as much. <laughs> it's easy. The Red Cross shows where the treasure is. But where in the garden are those two apple trees? Hmm, I don't know. Would you like a clue? Yes, please. The first clue is in a bottle. But where is the bottle? I can see it! <laughs> Pepper has found the first clue. A message in a bottle. Look, everyone! Here's the bottle! Well done, Pepper. Let's see what the message says. Oh, it's a message from a pirate. Mummy, can you read the pirate's message? Hmm. This pirate has very bad handwriting. The pirate's handwriting is excellent. No, I can't make it out at all. The pirate is clearly written. Follow the arrows. Follow the arrows? George has found the second clue. Sticks in the shape of an arrow. Look, they point this way. <laughs> Peppa and George are following the arrows. <laughs> Look, George, a key. Peppa has found the next clue. A key. Well done, Peppa. <laughs> now you just have to find the treasure chest that it unlocks. But there aren't any more clues. Maybe you should take another look at the map. Look, Peppa, the map has two apple trees on it. Here's an apple tree. And here's an apple tree. So the treasure must be here. Let's take a look. Oh, dear. There doesn't seem to be anything here. Hang on. There is something here. Treasure! Hooray! Well done, well done. <laughs> I've got the key to open it. 
Wow, I can't believe it. Gold coins. They must be worth a fortune. It's better than that. They're not gold coins. They are chocolate coins. And there's a chocolate coin for everybody. Hooray! <laughs> Pepper and George love chocolate coins. Everyone loves chocolate coins. Granny Grandpa, this is the best treasure hunt ever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Peppa Pig. This is my little brother George. This is Mummy Pig. And this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> The new car. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are going for a drive in their red car. Shall we have the roof down? Yes, please. <laughs> Peppa and George love their car. Is everybody ready? Ready. Then let's go. <laughs> and our car loves us too, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, the car does not sound very well. Mm. What's wrong, Daddy? Mm. Uh, I don't know. Let's take it to Grandad Dog's garage. He can fix it. That's a good idea, Mummy Pig. Grandad Dog runs the garage. He is very good at mending cars. Oh dear, Daddy Pig. Your car does not sound very well. Can you fix it, please, Grandad Dog? Yes, but it will take all day. Oh. We wanted to go for a drive in our car. Don't worry. You can borrow this new car while I fix yours. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Grandad Dog. Would you like the roof down? Yes, please. I'll just press this red button. What a clever car. Wow. When you come back, I will have fixed your car. Thank you, Grandad Dog. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Peppa and her family like the new blue car. There's so many buttons in this new car. What does the green button do, Daddy? Let's see. Magic windows! <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, make the magic windows go down. <laughs> <laughs> what does the blue button do? I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> I love this new car. Can we keep it? No, we can't keep it, Pepper. We've only borrowed it for today. Oh? Oh, no. I think it's going to rain. Yes, I'll just put the roof up. Now, which is the button to close the roof? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Silly me. <laughs> Aha! This must be the button. Ah! The new car has squirted Daddy Pig with water. <laughs> Silly Daddy, that's not the roof. This button. Oops, not that one. This button. <laughs> Daddy Pig has forgotten which button closes the roof. I don't think this car likes me. Let's try the red button. <laughs> but now it's stopped raining. Can we open the roof again? Uh, yes. Which button was it? The, the red, red one! one. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> Grandad Dog has fixed the car. Your car is fixed. Hooray! Hooray! Thank you, Grandad Dog. And keep the change. Thank you, Daddy Pig. <laughs>
Goodbye. 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 Bye-bye. Ah, oh, it's good to get our old car back again. I like the new car, but I like our old car better. And I think our old car likes us too, don't you? <laughs> my keys. <gasps> it's a week of mystery. Wear your sunglasses. On Mutton Stuff. I can't find Murray. When things go missing, you have a pack of detectives right here. The Mutton Stuff Detective Agency is on the case. Come on, doggy detectives. Use your noses. Watch them sniff out clues and dig up answers in a week of all new adventures starting Tuesday morning at 10 over on Nick. We don't decorate in one color. We don't stick to one fabric or one shape. So why use traditional aerosols that are one-dimensional? New Airwick Room Mist with Life Sense is a multi-layered fragrance, just like scents in real life. Our homes are rich, varied, and pleasantly surprising. And Airwick Room Mist is too. Finally, a true-to-life fragrance for your lively home. Airwick. Home is in the air. Introducing the Air Patroller. It changes from a helicopter into a jet. Manny's in trouble. With their new flight packs, the Paw Patrol team can fly and help save the day. Air Patroller comes with RoboPup, Air Rescue Pups, other vehicles in place that each sold separately from Spin Master. The you Paw Patrol you needs your help to save the day in Paw Patrol Pups to the Rescue. Now with five adventures in the new jungle location. Here we go. You'll romp through the jungle with the pups for some spectacular new saves. Help Sky soar in her helicopter to find Mandy the monkey. Guide Super Spy Chase in his suction cup boots to climb ruins. Join Rocky as he patches a damaged parrot nest and helps hatch eggs, and much more. Paw Patrol Pups to the Rescue is available for purchase on iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch. The Imaginex Hall of Justice is under attack. Team up and turn the power pad to transform Whoa! to battle mode. Ready! This wins! Imagine X Hall of Justice comes to show another toy sold separately. It's time for an animal rescue mission. Go Diego Go starts right after this. We'll be right back. There's nothing more amazing than these moments of learning. And since 85% of brain growth is complete by age three, now's an important time to nourish them. Enfigro Next Step is a milk-based toddler drink that has DHA, an important building block of the brain. Two servings a day give your toddler this important nutrient that may be missing from his diet. Try Enfigro Toddler and help set the stage now for all the amazing moments to come. Plants may have their limits. Imagination doesn't. With the right nourishment, Patience, care. One day, you seen your garden? It'll blossom. <laughs> Find low prices on the things that make Easter fun and delicious. Walmart. In a morning of back to back adventures, Blaze and his friends are going to extremes with their hottest, All right. coldest, <laughs> wildest. <laughs> Buggiest, Whoa. slickest, speediest, <laughs> sneeziest, <laughs> hugest challenges yet. Look out! Don't miss a morning of back-to-back -back adventures with Blaze, starting tomorrow at 11, right here on the Nick Jr. Channel. They're the best of the best. Yay! The cutest of the cute. Aww. The ones you count on most. We can do it! They're the Nick Jr. All-Stars. This is awesome! 
awesome! And you can find them every afternoon, right here on the Nick Jr. Channel. Ta-da! Every weekday starting at 4, catch all your favorite shows and adventures. <laughs> Whoa! High five! Including a special adventure... dino Rick. ...you can only find here. Coolio! It's All-Star Afternoons, weekdays starting at 4, right here on the Nick Jr. Channel. It's time to play with Nick Jr. On every Diego rescue mission, kids learn...